What's up guys, this is Chandler here for my nightly video. Tonight I wanted to talk about something that was, that's been on my mind. I did a podcast with someone a couple days ago and it was a pretty cool topic and the idea was what do we, how do we actually create a culture of caring and a culture where people know you're thankful and people know you're always going to be there for them and people know that you're always going to be the one to give them a little more than they're going to give to you. And it comes back to a story and the, the question that I was asked was, if you could go back in time or if you could meet anybody in the world ever, who would you who would you go back and talk to and meet? And when I thought about this question, it was, well, I don't really care to meet celebrities. I don't care to meet historical figures. None of that really matters because I don't know these people and I don't know who they really were. But the people I do know are the people I want to meet. And the one person that I would go back and meet and talk to if I had the opportunity would be my, my grandfather. He was the kind of person who went around town, when was universally liked and loved by everybody. He'd go, he'd walk down the street and everybody would say hello and hi and everybody always knew him as a nice guy who was always going to be there to help, always had a smile on his face and I've never heard a single thing bad about him from anybody. Everybody always just had universally good things to say and when you think about the way this works and even when I was a kid, he would pick us up, he would take us everywhere, he would always be pumped to hang out with all myself and all of my friends and this community we lived in was a small town and every single person in the town knew him. Every person in the town loved him and he was this kind of this joyful figure that everybody knew. And that's what you kind of do when you create this culture of caring. And what you want to do is in your business and even in your life, you always want to be willing to give a little more than other people are willing to give you and not expect anything in return. So you want to be the person who's always going to be there with a smile on your face, who's always willing to put in a little bit of extra work, who's always willing to put in a little bit of extra effort. But at the same time, understanding and knowing that some people are going to try to take advantage uh, from, with you. And when that happens, all you do is you just pull away and you don't interact with them as much. You don't need to be mean or a jerk or anything. You just pull away from that kind of environment, only interact and keep yourself around the good and the positive environments. But you always want to put yourself in a position to where if you looked back at you, you would say, was a great person, always put forth the effort, was always in a good position, always had a smile on their face, and I was a one person, if I could look back and think, I can depend on them, and I know they're never going to screw me over or stab me in the back. So in your business, a culture of caring is organizing this around your customers and your staff. They need to know that they can always depend on you. They need to know that you're going to follow through with everything, and they need to know that you're incredibly thankful for having them around and having their business. So think about that that little story. If I could go back, the one person I would meet and talk to again would be my grandfather. It's one of the greatest people I've ever known and one of the only people that I would actually go back and try to interact with. And that's what the culture of caring is really about. So if you guys are watching this, really think about that when you're going through life and when you're talking to people and when you're interacting. What can I do to make sure that my, I guess your legacy, is something that people look at and say, wow, what an amazing person, what a great person, and I have nothing bad to say about them. Hopefully you guys like this. If you have any questions or comments, post them, post them in the comments. See ya.